previously on The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. And also 20 bucks. Cool. Thanks. <laughs> My tip! Really? Fine, take the money I just got. Here. Yeah. I'm gonna need a little more to wet my whistle, if you know what I mean. Oh, for God's fine. Yeah. A little more, a little bit more. You are greedy as fuck, you know that? Fine, take all of that. Yeah. Thank you very much. Now, here's your receipt. God damn it, how did I think this was gonna go? And now back to, hey, Link, do you like boats? At this point, I have a very basic understanding of them. Hey. Nico B, back with some more The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. When we last left off, we traveled across the wild blue yonder. Lots and lots of exploring last episode. So we went from weird looking dice islands to finding some giant squids to running a boat course and just getting generally very lost. Until eventually I was just like, screw that, I'm going home to my grandma. And, oh no, my grandma's sick and I don't know what to do. So I did the only thing I could possibly think of, which was continuing the main story. <laughs> I'm sure main story will have the answers to what I need. So we return back to Windfall here and ran to our old pals, the uh, pirates again, who were uh, robbing the bomb shop owner guy of all of his bombs. But thankfully, our old pal Nico let us just go through a nice little obstacle course and then gave them all to us. And also, we found Tingle's camera. You know, in case we wanted to take some selfies along our adventure here. But yeah, as you guys can see, it's uh, we're sort of stuck in perpetual, like, rainy nighttime right now. And it's funny, I saw actually quite a few of you guys say apparently you were sort of almost disturbed by this weather when you were younger. Uh, someone actually brought up uh, something along those lines was uh, Call Mania, who last episode said, As a kid, this part of the game genuinely terrified me. I was convinced Ganondorf was actively doing things, and I was on a timer, and the storm weather could mess up every island if I took too long. I blame Majora's Mask for actually being on a timer. You know what? I can see myself thinking the same thing, honestly. It is kind of unsettling, just like how suddenly you just the 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 rain doesn't stop right and it didn't really indicate that that was going to happen like we just went to that island and it was just like pouring there and then after that it was just like it just doesn't stop no matter where you go and imagine yeah if you had played majora's mask before this you might think that everything is on on this inevitable doomsday timer the moon is going to be up there and it's just going to fucking crash right into our stupid faces at any moment oh man that would really blow it better not but Colomania, thank you so much for your uh, hilarious comment. And it's the reason you are comment of the day. Anyway, you guys clarified a few things because I actually, I kind of misunderstood a few things that uh, has been happening. First off, in regards to the squids, I, I thought it seemed like I was going in a specific order of hitting the eyeballs. It actually wasn't. Each of the eyeballs basically has an HP. So once you've hit it a number of times, then it will turn blue. So I, I see. Okay, okay. Another thing is that the, the pearls that I'm getting actually aren't required to, like, activate the shrines and get the songs. So the wind shrine that I actually got before was not because of the jewel that I got or the, or the pearl. It, I actually could have gotten it the moment I arrived on the island. I didn't even need the pearl for that, so... Okay, I guess that kind of makes sense because I technically, when I talked to the 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 guy before and got the the spell that changes uh, day to night and night to day, I didn't need a pearl or anything for that. Okay, that's that makes sense then. Oh, another thing you guys told me, and I, I can't actually believe this. So, what I thought about the Koroks and like the game isn't actually expecting me to go in a single what run right to to get them all. Turns out it actually is. You are expected to basically go from Korok to Korok in a single run to revive the, the little Deku saplings. So it's not just like one at a time. What the fuck, dude? That is, that's a very weird design choice. I don't know why they decided to go about it that way. I definitely don't agree with that. Now, I'm sure once you figure it out where they all are and mark them down, it's probably not too bad, but it's still a very like, why? <laughs> why would you do it this way? Because it inevitably just leads to a fucking shit ton of backtracking. And nobody likes that. Nobody likes backtracking. Which is why I do kind of hope that at some point I'll get like a, a song or something that'll just let me like fast travel to different locations. But I don't know. It might just be one of those games. I mean, this is definitely, an, it's an older Zelda game, right? It's not like technically I could do that really in uh, any of the Zelda games that are technically came before this with like Ocarina of Time or Majora's Mask. So it not, might not be that you can really do it here. I'd imagine, honestly, just based on the fact that this version does have additional quality of life changes and stuff, that if it is something that's in this game, I bet it wasn't in the original game. Oh, and finally, there's actually, now that I have the bombs, there's actually this optional thing that I can do, which I might 
consider trying to do here. And it actually involves the original, I think it was called the Tingle Tuner or whatever. The, the thing that in the original version of the game involved you connecting your Game Boy Advance to the game and getting some additional features that involve Tingle, right? So apparently in that version of the game, you could find and locate these things called like golden tingle statues and you use specifically that gameplay mechanic that you know your game boy advance and stuff and that device to find out where these statues were because they are completely invisible until you bomb very specific places however because that feature got removed from the game the statues which are still in this version of the game are basically completely unfindable unless you have a guide to it which is very kind of weird now that, that i'm hearing it that is like huh why didn't they think to put it back in because it's apparently still here and if you do get them all you do get something pretty cool so i actually might consider doing that though it doesn't mean i have to go back to the two temple areas that i've been to before because apparently they happen in i think just the temple areas and try seeing if i can't uh maybe get them all but okay so uh we got bombs cool and not to mention not just bombs but an absolute shit ton of them fucking what 30 bombs that's pretty damn good granted in this game i can actually uh i can actually use the bombs as like a cannon on my ship which is kind of neat so that's probably why they give me like so many right here at the start oh god damn it oh no that mail you bet your biscuits you do don't you want to see i really really don't anymore i feel like the less i interact with you the better come on it's a good mail is it though just go ahead and have a little readsy hey good evening well uh, not that it's ever gonna not be evening for a long time am i right am i right high five link no i'm not high-fiving that come on don't leave me hanging put that hand of yours down all right i'll save it for later let's flick we have one here's your letter oh god notice from beetle shop ship it's time for our semi-annual big chance extravaganza we have a new product that has burst onto the scene bombs wow great I'm, I'm so glad that you conveniently get this after i finally get it on myself you could have had it earlier and that would have saved me a lot of trouble we're having an extra special sale on this choice item for a limited time only You'll know where you to find us by checking the enclosed beetle shop ship chart or just looking to the fucking right of where you're standing. Visit a beetle shop today. Don't miss this huge opportunity. Oh, beetle's chart. Now you find where to find beetle slowing shop ships. Well, actually, it's kind of handy because there were a few places where I, I was sort of expecting it to, to show up and it uh, didn't. Well, what does it mean to the right of me? That, oh, God, he is. He's right there. Holy shit. Has he been there the whole time? How did you not notice that till now? You shut up, or I don't you judge me, Mr. Mailbox. Okay, I'm gonna look at this. Can you not like shoot me in the meantime? I'll be good. Oh, look at that. Whoa, <laughs> that's kind of freaky looking. Wait, what the hell? What's up with that one with the helmet on over there? Is it fucking Battle Beetle? Is he like gonna fight me to the death? That's a weird one. I almost wanna go check that shit out. I don't know that. I don't know how much exploring I wanna do right now when it's like perpetual fucking rainy nighttime here I feel like it's gonna limit probably the things and places i can go i did have somebody say that i should very much consider going to the places where the little fairies are here i mean granted didn't i did i go to the one down there actually that's that's actually where outside island is so okay i mean i might consider doing that i assume that one in the bottom to the, my bottom left is actually where tingle is like that's his home or something but all right i'll consider it Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, I got you good, didn't I? I really don't like interacting with you. <laughs> I love you, too. I'm getting the crap out of here. Hey, how's it going? Hold on, our preparations are complete. You got the bombs. Cool. So what the girl says is true. The pirates won't be leaving until morning, which, I mean, to be fair, I don't think we have to worry about that ever happening, because Tom Day's never going to change, right? You must be with your boon and give the pearl from him, get from him before they arrive. Or get the pearl from him. Let's not any longer, Link. So wait, if the, if the pearls aren't unlocking the new songs, what the hell do they do? I don't know, they're just some mystical cool item. Like the Triforce. Except not the Triforce. Yeah, but what does it actually do? I don't know, man. It's, it's important and mystical and need to do the thing to, to, to do the, the other thing to do the thing that needs to be done. All right, so get in the fucking boat. All right, stop asking questions. Ah, <sighs> fine. Okay, before we do that, though, we gotta go check out one of the other fairy spots. Why? I don't know. Penguin recommended it. What's a penguin? Shut up. All right, this, wait, wait, you don't know what a penguin is? No, 
I guess there's no real icy places here. It would be kind of weird if there were penguins out here. God, I don't like this new music we have. It's freaky, right? I don't like it either. Okay, so I think it's, it is to my upper left here. I was kind of assuming that this is like, like what the, the fairy fountains are, quote unquote fairy fountains, the, where the big fairies are that I gotta go kill squids to, to interact with. Okay, I'm heading to something. Oh. Oh, one of these places? I did come across, yeah, one of these. But I couldn't really go in there because of weird tentacles and shit. What the hell is that? Oh. oh, I can actually, that's right. Now I think I can fuck around with these ships, right? Because I got the bombs. So I, I can actually attack and shoot at them. Oh, I can go in here now. This guy, this guy seems to always be here when he's looking at like the seagulls, right? Oh, so that's how it works. I guess. I don't see anything though. What the hell is that? Oh, that's freaky. Is that what you're looking at? I think it is what you're looking at. So what do we, uh, uh, what, 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 what are we, what are we doing here? Why is there always a hole in the ground? Oh, okay. So this is kind of different, isn't it? Hello there, fairy. Oh, oh you're not, oh, you're just like the other lady. Yeah. Oh, they're not big and busty and fat as fuck. Oh, I miss those ladies. Big chunky girls. Damn. Damn, I like them big and chunky. I mean, what? Young Wicker of the Winds, allow me to teach you a new quest. Okay. Just, just like that? You don't even know what my quest is or what I'm doing or who I am. And okay, just blow pollen on me. Ugh. You ne can now. Oh, thank fuck. Oh, thank God. Okay. Well, there it is. Yeah, that's definitely useful. I kind of figured this was gonna be like something you can only get from like an auction house, but okay. Yeah, that that's worthwhile. First, the fountain shall ease your weariness when you grow fatigued when your battles come here to be refreshed. Interesting. So I get I get walled expansions from the fairies? That wasn't like that in any of the previous games, I think. Right? Right. God, I hope I'm not misremembering that. For sure, I always like found it or bought it or something. Okay, I guess I can also take a fairy with me, right? Yeah. Save me from death. Oh, the little fairy looks so sad. Your love actually runs that collapse from exhaust. This fairy will punish your strength against their will. Sorry. Just, you know, just in case you look so sad. It's kind of fucked up, actually. I think I liked it better when you guys were just little balls of light and I couldn't see your expressions. Your dour expressions as I kidnap you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> They're like, no, give us our sibling back! Okay, bye! Thank you! Fuck you! Huh. So what are... Was this one... Oh, no, the mailbox again? That's right! Come on, man, really? So I wonder what... Was this one already just open by default? I wonder if the other one is open then. The one with all the, all the tentacles on it. Uh-oh. Don't shoot bombs at me. God, really? I know a double in a single episode! Aren't you lucky? Good evening, lovely. We got one letter. Here you go. Oh, God. I'm sorry to disturb you with this unsolicited letter. If the following does not interest you, please throw the letter away without a second thought. Okay. <laughs> Apparently, he thought you might do that. So just in case, he sent me a backup. <laughs> oh, great. Thanks. But this is your big chance. Do you have a need of an empty bottle, a piece of heart, or a treasure char? We have them at special bargain prices but we have only one of each. If you're interested, go to the shop ship near the Rocket Spire Island. First come, first serve. I can't wait to serve you. Where the heck is that? To those who took time to read this letter, please accept my humble thanks, Assistant Manager, Rock Spire Shop Ship. Oh, oh wow. That's just, that's just great. Yeah, he really wanted to butter me up good, didn't he? <laughs> great, that's worth one ruby. Better collect lots. Well, okay, that's interesting. Again, I don't know where that is. I haven't come across that. I better grab the 
fish too while I'm here. Oh crap, I'm on a bait. Shit. Damn, if I realized that, I would have uh, talked to Beetle. Is Beetle up here? Nobody's below me. Ah, I'm coming in hot. Ah, ah. Okay, at least I hopped up easily that time. All right, so you got bombs, huh? I sure do. And also some more of that sweet, sweet bait. Hey, oh, Miss Fire, you're doing, acquainted with the normal pile girl. You have a bashful look on her face, this customer. You can't hide from me. Uh -huh. What the hell are you talking about? I barely know her. She's fucking weird. And girls have cooties. Anyway, a bowels thing. Thank you. All right, I got the bait. Cool. Let's go talk to some fish. A little, uh, little castle over here. Is there a guy up there? Hold on. One thing at a time. Oh, small fry! What the fuck did you do? The whole fucking ocean's underwater! What? So much rain and you fucking drowned in the ocean! I don't... I don't even know what to freaking say to that. Do something about it, small fry! First of me, slap your mat. Blah! Spectacle Island. Where the night when the crescent moon faces up. So I like to tell you, small fry. All right, me and more ghost ship things which I can't do anything about. All right, great, thanks. Oh, God. Oh, hey. It's a freaking blue guy. Come here. Ah, blah. Ah, ah. Oh, crap, I threw it in the ocean. I don't think I can actually smack him when he's like this. I think the only way I can do anything, I think it's just like my boomerang. Oh, I see. If I already stole his blue, uh, his blue stuff, then he just drops me money. Head west from here to reach the mother and child aisles. Oh, I wish I had a mom, but I got a grandma. That's just as good. At least I think so. What the heck? That's why I'm here too. Is there anywhere where you're not? Nope, I'm everywhere. Just like that way fish keep talking to. Good. Great. Hello? Wait, you? Dude, what are you doing up here? He's sleeping. Bro. He's sleeping while holding the sign, too. See, I am already closed for today. Mm, come again tomorrow. Wow. Now that is some dedication to your job. I'm gonna fire the can to wake him up. Ah! Damn it. Here. This will wake you up. Hold on to that. Oh shit, I fucking killed him. Better bail. The Northern Fairy Island is to the north. No shit. Did you kill a guy? What? Wait, wait, why would you say that? No, no, of course not. Really? Because you have a look on your face like I just killed a guy. And what kind of look is that? Like a look on your face right now. I didn't, I didn't, no, I didn't kill anybody. Okay. Well, why do you have a look like, I don't have a look like anything. Uh, okay, yep, Northern Fairy Island. Shape of a heart. Little short master of Windfall Island Pelagos hands on a truly amazing treasure. He calls it magic armor or something like that. It's pretty cool magical relic, from what I've heard. We want him to get to you. Try staring him deep into his eyes and winning him over with flattery fry. <laughs> Why'd you laugh at that? Because he's dead inside and he can never love anyone. Oh. Anyway, that's all I got. See you later, bitch. Huh. I'm gonna see what this guy was looking at. It's like a thing over here. Ah, uh, another submarine. Oh, interesting. We've got uh, swinging. Yeah, fuck this. I don't need to. I don't need to fight these guys. Oh shit! Don't mind me. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Don't mind me. Don't back up. There we go. Yeah, you're fine. Thankfully, these guys are too stupid to figure out ladders. There we are. Ta-da! All right, this time I can actually take more money because I got a bigger wallet. But if you have something else, that'd be even better. Oh, another treasure chart, okay. Works for me. An X next to a thing that looks like a little bean. All right, enjoy your sub out here in the middle of the ocean. Bye-bye. I'm kind of to see where the Tingle's house thing is. So it's, I, I assume that that's probably where he actually went after he uh, left. Let's go ahead down there. Oh, hey, it might have been to this guy's area, actually. 
the charge is gone. Oh, heck yeah, baby. Yep, sure was. Oh, I see seagulls, I think. Wait. Really? Huh, weird. There's seagulls out here in the middle of the ocean, but no giant squid. Oh, uh, yep. There's a house in the shape of Tingle's head. That definitely seems like his house. That does seem like that kind of house he would have. But also fishy. Tingle Island. Yeah, and he would name it after himself, too. Let me tell you a little something about that island over there, small fry. Stay the fuck away. Some weirdo and green tides will come over and talk your freaking ear off. Dude, I already have that problem with like 30 other characters, including you. The guy who lives there is named Tingle, but he won't grow up and act his age. He's still dressed like a little kid. That is not normal. Still, from what I hear, he can decipher maps like nobody's business. Just goes to show you that you can't judge a person on appearance alone, Fry. You might be a fucking weirdo, but weirdos have their uses, right? I mean, look at you. Yeah, look at you. Oh, hey. You got spunk. I like you, kid. Of course, the thing about this Tingle guy is that when it comes to time to pay his deciphering fee, you better be ready to walk out some serious dough. Anyone who doesn't have a deep wallet won't be reading any maps, that's for sure. That's all the info I got to offer. If you want to hear it again, you suck my balls. Okay, so he'll... I assume he'll just tell you where, like, treasure maps go for a big price. That does not sound worth it. At least not currently. All right, another, another one of you and I, ah, and screw this. Ugh. Blow you to smithereens, maybe. There we go. Uh, the way to Northern Fair Island is to the north. Increase your fortune. Yeah, oh yes, you're telling me that now. I've kind of already figured that out. This looks kind of conspicuous. No? Huh. Does it actually look like my, uh, how my pearls are set up here? Uh, well, uh, no, actually it looks like I'm only getting three of these pearls. And then whatever that is. This is an interesting tower. What the hell? There are other tingles working under him? They're, are these slave tingles? In. You have a tingle bubble, do you not? Uh... No, if you're not really a fan of it, uh, don't worry about such things. Tingle bottle, sort of complicated, I suppose. Doesn't really work on emulation. No, 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 don't go your way. No, really. I mean, it's quite amusing, Tingle bottle. I mean, but not really. I, I would not expect you to. Hey, oh, get back to work. Get back to work, slave. You. Ah, oh, yeah, sorry, boss. Help me. Help me. Please save me, like. Ah, this is so heavy. Just treat you and me. This guy's another brother. I think I could just come spin this thing instead of me. <laughs> I said get back to work. This is very unusual. Very, it seems like cruel and unusual punishment. What are they even doing? They're spinning the, my giant head. Oh, Mr. Fairy, I'm longing to see you, sir. Did you get my iPhone camera? I did. What should we play? What do you want to play? What? You don't need to play. Next time, bring me some of one of my favorites. A chart I haven't seen. Please, sir, just bring me one, please. Goodbye, Mr. Fairy. Please come visit me in your Tingle Tower, where wonderful fairy magic makes the place spin and spin. So, like, can I actually, like, equip a, a chart here? Like, how do I even do that? I don't think I can actually put my charts in my options here. One of my favorites. A chart I haven't seen. I assume he means, like, these. But how do I show it to him? No idea. I seemingly can't, really. Whatever, figure it out another time. I mean, based on what it, the description sounds like, it doesn't really sound like it's all that useful right now anyway. Okay, now before I go and do anything, let's head back to the places where I came from, i.e. Dragon Roost Island and then the Forsaken Woods or Forbidden Woods or whatever it's called. What if I can do anything actually with this? this pot over on Paw Print Island here, this weird giant glowing egg thing. Can I like blow you up now? Eat this big glowing thing. Ugh. Well, I'm all out of ideas. Oh wait, hold on. How about this weird frog thing? Uh, doesn't seem to be. Hmm. Actually, you know, it's funny now that I have bombs, I might be able to also do stuff here. Maybe. I just realized there's these things over here, which I might be able to, can I swing up to? Hey, I can. I could swing and then climb. 
Okay. Uh, and then climb again. Cool. I see a chest over there as well. Can I throw my boomerang at these bombs or something? No, I do not appear to be able to. Hey, look, somebody new here. Hey man, I'm the new park timer. Green clothes and green hat. Probably for asking, but you're Link, aren't you? Yeah, it's me. Ha, I knew it. You're a legend of one of the park timers here. Really admire you, man. Just once, I'd love to see the, see the legendary 25 letter sword. Do your best, man. Oh, okay. Whoa, what? I wasn't expecting. No countdown or anything. That was close. Okay, you sir caught me off guard, man. There we go. Gosh, 20 letters, amazing, man. I'm so impressed, seriously, man. I gotta tell my mom back home all about this. Just gotta. Got a favor to ask you, man. I'm still new here, so I'm not allowed to leave, so would you mind putting this letter to my mom in the post box for me? Thanks a lot, man. Oh my god, I finally sang the mail to somebody else. Thank god. You sent a note to mom. It's so sad you can almost cry. Keep it in your delivery bag and okay. Guess I could just throw it in here with all the other letters, but just keep yourself to it. Let's guess the rules, man. Okay. Well, I finally have something to give the post the, the post box without him shooting me. Hopefully. In theory. Holy crap. Will this work? I don't know. Uh, yeah. yeah. Did it do it? Yep. Oh, I totally did, baby. Holy crap, I got it. Oh my, yeah, I did not think that was gonna work. What'd I get? Ah, some money. All right, I'm down. Ha, cool. I'm really proud of myself, hey, I'm so smart. Okay, so. Apparently, there is a sta tingle statue over here. I just need to bomb this random spot. So, uh, oh God. Well, okay, who would have thunk it? Thanks, non-existent Game Boy Advanced. The dragon tingle statue bubbles over with warmth. This will be waiting for it will be waiting for you on Tingle Island. Okay, I'll just transport over there. All right. Neat. Okay, that's done. Another real question. How the fuck do I get back over here? Oh, actually. I can just do this. Yeah. Oh lord, here it comes. Wait, 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 wait. I actually just need to deliver this time. That's what you always say. No, I'm serious. Look. An actual parcel. Well, what do you know? Hell can't actually freeze over. Hmm. That actually tastes pretty good. That's some genuine article mail if I ever saw some. This post box is near Dragon Roost Island. Postage is only five rupees. Oh, I gotta pay postage? Of course you do. All right, five rupees is not that bad. I'll send this. Your parcel is still my extended for delivery. Thank you for using the Isle of Postal Service. We appreciate your business. That's it? That's it! Oh. Oh. What? I don't know. I just... I thought I still was going to die. I think I'm just so used to it now. Nope, you did it. You're good. Okay? 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 Okay. Get the hell out of here! Okay, all right, all right. So, man... Let me in on a little secret, man. All letters and addresses to you are specifically delivered to the post box close to you. Man, what island you have to be on? So cool, man. I've heard all about the work you did here. Really been through some rough times, man. Way to go. Hey, man, that's what? We've all been there, right? Uh, okay, so he didn't say anything about the letter, so. Wait, so where did he say his mom was, specifically? I'm not even actually sure. Can I go find her or something? Oh, hey, I found one of the fucking squids. I thought there was one over here. Time to get wrecked, Mr. Squid. This time I know your weakness. I mean, to be fair, I knew what it was before. I just literally couldn't do anything to it. There we go. Take that, you big meanie. Hi, melting! Melting! Okay, no great fairy that time either. I'm thinking maybe a heart piece? Oh, an orange rupee. I think I can't ever come across one of those. 
Oh, hey, there we go. I find a whirlwind and it just spins me around. Okay. Nothing too crazy. Oh, hey, the ghost ship's out. Can I actually do anything? Uh, I don't think so. Oh, hey. Let me come back here. This is the uh, island where one of the merchants was. Because we got these big old, what looks to be bombo rocks. Heck yeah. Oh, hey, okay. Uh. But. Oh, hey, I know what to do. No, 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 no. Oh, oh God, there's one behind me. Uh, uh. Stay there. Oh God, where am I going? Oh, that seems very precarious. Ah. Okay. Some timed. Uh. Okay. Big chest over there. Got these things. Um. Oh. I get what I gotta do. Hey, big guy, come here. Bonk. Uh. Ah, crap. So you can actually pull it back before it's, it's actually hit the enemy. If you're like pressing it too hard, too much. Yeah. Oh, no way. No freaking way I didn't hit the button. Are you kidding me? Please tell me he'll get up and just step on it. How, what? Really, they made it that actual, like actually finicky to hit? Well, that's a bitch. There we go. Uh, 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 ah, crap. Gotta be pretty straight. There we go. Okay, this one took a lot of effort, so it better not just be money. Ah, heck yeah. And that was the fourth one. Give me another heart, baby. Woo, cool. That was fun. Little mini dungeon. Ow. Go ahead and use that new heart of mine by burning my ass. Yo, what up, great Decker Tree? What are you doing back here? Shouldn't you be out saving my children? How are things in the world, Link? As you can see, I am slowly dying inside. It seems only my wisdom is full of vigor lately, but uh, that's just the way of life, child, and not cause for sadness. Yeah, good thing I'm young and I'll stay young forever. So anything you wish to ask, I will aid you as I may. Oh, that's right, this shit. Ah, fuck. Oh, hey. If you see the Korra... Oh, I, I... I talked about the forest water. Apparently, that triggered this. If you see the Koroks in trouble out there, I hope you can aid them all with forest water potent. I shall mark the locations on your C chart. What is that? Is that... Is that the mark? Is that a Korok? I don't even know what I'm looking at right now. But I don't see the mark anywhere else. Weird. So if it's if that's a Korok right there, but that's actually not where I came across one. I think I came across another Korok was like over here. But I don't see him marked anywhere. I'm very confused. Actually, I think I can get over to this guy over here if I just change the wind direction. What is going on over here? Oh, can I uh, hit this or something to knock it down? Oh wait, no, this will probably, this will probably do that. Place of figurines. Oh, this is it. Nintendo gallery membership required to enter. Yo, Grimms, did you just fly down here? That's the coolest thing ever. Hey, if you can fly, can you maybe hit this that switch over there? Mm huh? Can you? Oh, you can't see it. It's just over. There, up toward the top of the forest, David. Don't you have a telescope? I mean, who doesn't in this day and age? Uh, oh. That thing way over there? Oh, man. Can, can I? Can my boomerang go that far? That seems really far, man. Oh, I don't know about that. Maybe... Maybe this? Hit it, burb. 
Hit that shit. Uh, uh, oh my god, it did. Yeah! Good job, Burb. I'm proud of you. Farewell, Burb. Oh boy. The Nintendo Gallery. So, you remember this whole time? Awesome. Thanks to you, I got in and became a member too. Check it out, I gave this guy a photograph and he gave me this figurine in return. Talk about cool. This will be all the rage. Oh. Oh, it's actually some quest tied to this. Welcome. Welcome to Nintendo Gallery Figurine Palace. This is your first time here, isn't it? Did one of our members provide you with an introduction, I hope? Oh, well, no worries. One way or the other, we've been losing members due to our lack of gimmicky attractions. But we don't worry. True fans know we're the coolest. So anyway, do you know what it takes to become a member of our club? Figurines we have on display ha here have all been made using pictographs provided by our devoted members. If you bring me the master sculptor a pictograph that steals my breath away, then you'll become a member and you'll be able to view the collection in our galleries. And won't that be nice? Do you have such a pictograph? Uh, I sure do. Check it out. Boom. I show it to you? As far as what kind of pictograph has the power to steal my breath away, well, it could be either a person or a monster. You'll just have to be careful to take a full body shot with your subject facing you. Until you bring me a subject that I that I like, you can't join. Sorry, but that's just the way cookie crumbles. I am making these figures for free, so I figure I should be allowed this one little rule, don't you? Well, how about this guy right here? <laughs> hey, how's it going? Don't mind me. Can I pose? Oh, I can't. Ah, <laughs> Hi there, my name is Toon Link, and I'm here to stream my first ever video. That's right, I'm a content creator now. God help us all. That was a good picture. That's definitely, I'm gonna get a million views for that. I did it, I got a picture. How I know it's gonna be something you wanna see though? Oh, hey, I just realized he's got some of the Majora's masks up there. You got like Pikachu and the Goron and the bunny. Huh. So these are like locked until. Yeah. Huh. So it's based on. Okay, I see. And they're based on locations too, which means that these. Some of these might be spoilery for places I'm going to go at some point. Okay. Well, that's neat. Ah, I gotta make my way back all the way over here again. Can I take a picture of you? Uh -huh. Oh, pfft. I'm sorry. I'm an idiot. This is my boat. That's just my boat. That's what that's it. That's my boat. Well, in that case, then he says he marks it on my map, but I don't see any indication. Huh? I don't know what the hell that old man was talking about. Okay. The other one should be over here, but first I'm gonna take care of these guys. No? Oh, I'm in the wrong spot. Wrong island. This is the island. Here we go. The forbidden tingle statue. It's covered in sticky sap. At least that's what I hope it is. Okay. Well, there we go. I got those done at least. Not to worry ever coming back. back I'm ever coming back here ever again. Hopefully. Okay. All done. Okay. We're actually ready to go do what you're supposed to be doing. Yes. No more pit stops are ever fucking going. Well, at the very least, I can clear the path of the way there. Oh, for God's sakes. Come on. Go ahead and just clear out this map. What the heck is that? Oh my God, it's surrounded by wind and stuff. That looks foreboding. Ice Ring Isle. That's probably a temple or something there. Or a dungeon. This is amazing treasure inside that freezing ring of ice over there. But if you want to and try to get inside, you just be frozen solid as you approach the shore. But if you go four squares north and three squares west, you'll find the power to melt any ice, no matter how cool. Search for that small fry. Again, I probably can't access it yet, but okay, thanks. Yeah, that's the, again. Well, actually, no, there was one thing to, to freeze and then a power seemingly to melt as well, huh? Because we came across a, like a big fiery volcano that I couldn't do anything with either. Oh, hey, I see another fairy home. Can I go in or is it blocked by... It is blocked by wood. It's not by tentacles this time. 
Uh, probably means I can just bomb it, right? That's not what I wanted to do. That's also not what I wanted to do. I'll just kill you while I'm at it. There we go. All right, well, what does this one entail? quest okay you also gonna give me a fatter wallet or something <laughs> it's kind of funny again i find it funny that leather one gave me like the mystical power of bigger wallet oh i can carry more but wow here bring a maximum of 60 hell yeah baby get out of my blooming way first one should ease your awareness when you were fatiguing your battles <laughs> Okay, thank you. All right, well, that's cool. More bombs is always good. Guess it makes sense that I require bombs to get in here. I wonder if we used to get past the tentacles then. May fire or something? Okay, so that was the Southern Fairy Island. Listen up, small fries, it's just between you and me. On the outside island, babe, beneath the black soil, there's some serious treasure. I know it sounds like I'm trying to pull your leg, but I'm serious, try digging there. Beneath the black soil try digging there i don't know how to dig though what are you talking about you just stick your hands in the dirt and you're fucking moving out of the way yeah it's too hard well you don't have anything anything to dig with i'd say try using an animal or something look smart and a hard a small fry animal like a like a pig or something am i sticking up truffles uh okay huh the only thing i think of is the pigs so we're the only other animals i really come across here something like birds and shit and the monsters. It actually does sound like I might be digging up truffles. Holy sh Nikes, look at the size of that cyclone. Oh, uh, what are you doing? What, what do you mean? What are you doing? We're going right for it. Uh, oh, 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 what the hell? Foolish creature who doth, who does not fear the gods. To the end of the sea with you. Let the winds of Cyclone's wrath blow you away. No, no, no. What did I? Uh oh. Wait. Can I do something? Oh dear. No, you idiot! Ah! Ah! Where did it send the send me? What? You all right? Seems the side, the wind got cyclones burst the middle water towards humans. To go forward, it would be wise to not trace second by any cyclones you see upon the sea. Uh, if only we could find a way to harness the power of those cyclones, it might be possible for us to travel across the ocean instantaneously. <gasps> oh, okay, good. There, there is actually a method of fast travel in this. Cool. Do not have an item that can, pier that can pierce distant targets? If you did, you might be able to obtain such a power. Keep that in mind for the future. Okay, I'm at Tingles Island. Okay, we're not too far. Oh, there's a holy boatload of treasure around this thing. Again, showing up only at night. So we got another dice area. Cyclops Reef. Snake eyes. See those weird rings of light that appear on the sea? Seas at night, haven't you? Yeah, well, this thing's a sure sign of this treasure in the deep fry. Deep fry. Let me tell you, there's some lights that don't always shine. Yeah. There's these special ones that shine like crazy. But only when you open a treasure chart. They say those are the marks that are the greatest treasures are hidden. It's all like alpha. Okay, yeah, that's kind of what I noticed. Yeah, the, the ones that are actually from the, the, the treasure charts shine way brighter. Anything significant here? Not really seeing anything. I'm sure there is something, but we'll, if it is, we'll save for another time. Just kind of working my way back over here. Stone Watcher Island. Tell me, Smart Fly, have you heard about the Golden Triumph Forks? I forgot, six, these fucking forks again. There's such things. That island there is one of these golden items you keep hearing about. You want? Try asking that huge grouchy stone looking stone watcher. Daddy can even budge the thing there. You got skinny arms, right? All right, suck my balls. Okay, so this is got one of the giant head things that I can't do anything with. Oh, there's a guy looking somewhere though. All right, whatever. We'll worry about it later. Okay, there's the cyclone again. Let's stay away from it this time.
What? No, 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 what, what? what? I'm not even, I'm not even that close to you, dude. Oh, are you serious? Are you, what? Okay, apparently I do not have to be that close to it to trigger it. Does it just send me somewhere totally random? Sure does. It's not that far at least. Okay. After many, 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 many distractions, I have finally way, made my way back home. Huh. Took your sweet time. Have you noticed, like, morning has not broken since we arrived at Great Fish Isle? Yeah, no shit. Hasn't broken for like the last like 10 days. Line that was so ravaged by monsters, as if, as if time has froze, itself has frozen. Maybe it's the curse Volu spoke of. Yeah, again. Probably don't have to wait, worry about waiting till morning, because morning's never gonna come. Or the reason, if this not just not end, then we need not worry about the pirates overtaking us. Yeah, see? In fact, it might not be a bad if we visit your hometown and family again after such a long time away. We speak your moon after you do. Oh, okay. Well, I already did that and saw my grandma wasn't feeling great, but I guess now I gotta do it for story, main story reasons. Maybe I'll actually like react this time. I was so shocked before, I just kind of rolled it off and then poured water on her lap like a big doofus. Ah, Link girl, don't let go, don't leave up, poor, poor grandma all alone, grandma. All right. Oh, okay, still, still sick. I visited with them. Or do I have to go check with everybody else too? Is everybody in the village sick too, maybe? What the heck is this old man doing? Hey, hey, Link, you're all right. Why did you not tell me about Errol? That was thoughtless of you. I should smack you upside the head for that shit. Yeah, and I said, this is a hard time since you departed. Mm, I don't know what you've been doing on your journey. I've seen a little more daring these days. Look in your eyes at the one you left with here. Very good, show me how much you've improved with your forward skills. Okay. I haven't really learned anything, but okay. I can... Oh yeah, bow, yes. Bow, what, fight. Must say so, your skills with the sword are still at the level of a page. Very good, try to meet a hundred or, or more times before I hit you three times. What? A hundred or more times? Holy shit, I'm gonna be here fucking all day. Enough, you suck. So many blows, eh? Remember, you may grow strength. Others grow stronger as well. Go practice as much as you want. I see one of those knight's crests over there. He's actually the one who reached out to me about those too. Here, let me show, let me show him one. Check it out. Oh. Why, that is a knight's crest. How many of those do you have? Come and see me once you have collected 10 of the knight's crests. I can just you what they are for. Oh, 10, okay. Sure, I guess I just need to make sure to block, honestly. <laughs> Have at thee, old man. I've seen the, the option there. I don't know what's like. I seem to like get it though. Yeah, I think all it does is, I don't know. I think it's a counter or something, but all I'm doing, I'm just getting, I'm eating shit every time. So fuck it. All right, I did it. I did it. I, I guess the Venice League hit me. Enough! Uh, I'm five blows you have approved. I guess it was wrong of me to treat you like you were a lowly page. You're a page no more. You are, now you are a knight. Oh, thank God. Knight, here's not much, but it's yours. Take this with you. <laughs> Thanks. That's it. They're gonna teach me some new dank shit. Dumb old man. Okay, I gotta trade like 10 of these Knight's Crest to this guy too. Hopefully it gives me more than just money. Man, I thought he was gonna teach me a new move or something. I feel so blue balled. Are you ready? Oh, okay. Wait, wait, isn't your grandma sick? Yeah, but apparently it doesn't matter enough to, I don't know. I don't know, man, it's just, I'm not reacting here apparently and we're just gonna let it let it slide. In this case, we must search for the cave around the backside of the outside where Jaboon is to set to hide. Uh, okay, so around the back. Oh boy. 
Jabooba! Well, that looks like something significant. That's squid. Uh. Hello? We're throwing a bomb or something? Oh, yeah. Here we go. Guess I'm doing it. Uh, kind of weird that it's just like a whirlpool here. And no dude or anything. Guess I just gotta get it before uh, it sucks me down. Here we are. And just like that, it's gone. All done. What was that about? I have no idea. Holy snikes. That's a big ass fish. Don't eat me, eat the child. Hey. Well met indeed, Jaboon. I am pleased to see that you are safe. How you doing, my dude? I told you, all right, I got the money, all right? I got the money, I got the money. The drugs must sell like hotcakes, all right? Wait, does this have to do with that other guy you were talking with? What? No, it has nothing to do with that. I don't know that guy, and I don't know this guy. I've never met him before. Yes, it seems Ganon has returned. There can be no other explanation. What a dickhead, right? Unfortunately, that is not so. Sorry. The one I have brought with me has no connection to the legendary one. He's just some dumb, smelly weeb. Yeah, I'm not really anybody. Hey, I don't smell bad. No, but your clothes do. It's true, they do. Yes, yeah, that's great promise and the courage this one possesses. Or maybe stupidity, I haven't figured it out. I do. It is the only way. I'm starting to think, you, do you really understand what he's saying? Of course I do. <laughs> oh, okay. Thanks. Naru's Nehru's Pearl, the water spirit Jaboon was kind enough to give you this jewel, a treasure of one of the goddesses. Okay, again, what do I do with all these things then? I got three, I can get a, do a good juggling act. Okay, bye. Yeah, la 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 to you too. Dude, you just told him his mom was hot. What? And then you're gonna slap her ass and call her Sally. What? No, nah, I'm just playing with it. You were just making weird noises. So that foul rain and endless night were indeed elements of a curse brought on us by Ganon. We must attend to cast this land in pure darkness for all time. I believe I have. Okay. Good talking to you, bro. Can you translate any of that? No. Ganon's curse has been broken by the power of the pearl that Jaboon gave us. Uh, that was easy. So morning should come soon. It's well that we gathered all the pearls. Are you ready, Link? Wait, that's that's it? Yep, yeah, that's it. I like dungeon or anything? Nope, fuck you. I right, mark the place where you must set the pearls on your sea chart. Once you have placed each of the pearls in the proper location, the proving grounds for your courage will become apparent. Clearly, the search for Jaboon has shown that Ganon has begun to make efforts to block our path forward. It's certain that the perils ahead will be greater than any you have faced thus far. Especially any business you have here on outset right now, so you should not have any regrets ever again. Okay. Isn't there supposed to be a fairy fountain or something here? That's kind of funny. There's really not like a, a dungeon for this one? That was it? I guess maybe the dungeon was like figuring out the thing with the pirates, but it wasn't really... I wouldn't even want to call that a dungeon. Forest of fairies. Oh, these are new. Yeah. This thing's doing up here. Get out of here. What the heck? You're up here too? Now what are you looking at? Oh, hell, I can fly to the top of that hill if only. Beat that rock. The trouble. I need to speak out loud with it. Without thinking, it's a secret. Yes, quite a secret. Okay. 
So, glide over there, but that's a big heavy rock thing that I can't do anything with. Oh wait, can I even, I can't even go back over here. Fairy found sight ahead, increase your, oh, it is. Wait, how do I get back over here if the fucking bridge is gone? Oh, wait, can I, that's right, I forgot I can fly. Yeah. Is there like a rock to blow up? Oh, there is, there's one. Very fun sight. Let's hear a hero comes here. The battles. Uh, the, 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 all right. Wow. So I, I guess it is. This is going to be another uh, increase my wallet size. I guess that's just what the fairies are here for. In addition to other stuff. Man, what's it going to raise it up to now? So I, I go up to a thousand. I'm going to raise it up to like 5,000? 9, 9,999? Young Winter Cove Winds, let me your request. Check this shit out. I got you an even bigger wallet. Ooh. Whoosh. Oh my God, I feel the power of more money. Ah. 5,000 rupees. I'm going to bet that's probably the max. Okay, cool. Wow. I can hold an absolute metric shit ton of money now. Go me. Oh, hey, look at these guys. Aren't you just hot stuff? I'm just gonna leave you alone. How about that? Oh, that's a big pig. Can I? That's a huge. Holy crap, I can't even lift him. What the heck have they been feeding this pig? Oh my god, he's gotten so huge. Holy, holy moly. Lady, what did you do to the pig I gave you? You might have fed him a little too much. Oh, look, you made it back. That's the thing's been happening here ever since the night you, you left on the boat. Better head home early. I don't come back I'll out until play until long after the sun has risen tomorrow. I'm so glad you're safe, Link. You've all been so worried. Most of me so surprised to return just as soon as they wake up, that is. Eh, this kid sleeps with it. Still got the snot bubble coming out of his nose. I wonder what Dark Soil was referring to, specifically for the treasure to dig up. And I assume it's gotta be a pig. Oh, this spot right here. Yeah. This has gotta be it. Are there even any other pigs here that aren't huge? So maybe I should change the time of day. You know our pet pig? Well, to be honest, we named him after you. Lucky you. It's very smart, it's just like you. And just like you, when you feed him some bait, he starts digging with all his might until he digs up treasure. Wait, you don't do that. What might you testing your mind by picking up that pig? Like as long as you take him for a walk after, what do you say? I can't. Uh, so I can't do it yet. I have to, I have to get like some strong, some buff that lets me, it's gonna be the same thing. It probably lets me lift the statues. It's also to lift him. Unless I can blow him out or something or blow him up. Okay, good, I didn't kill him. <laughs> okay, I don't think that's, uh, unless I can make him jump over the fence here. No. First way smart, just like you, unlike you when you feed him some bait. Okay, okay, yeah, so yeah, it is, it is him. It is what I thought. Oh, there's another spot right here too. But until I get that power or whatever, I won't be able to do anything. Well, all right, guys, I think this is probably a uh, good spot to end things here for now. We've got the three pearls, which will seemingly unlock. Maybe it says the act of courage. It's almost made me think maybe this will be like the place where you go get the master sword. I assume that's in this game or something. I definitely need to go to, back to the auction house, though, and probably buy some more stuff because I got so much money. At least now that it's daytime, I can actually do stuff. And not to mention buy at the shop if there's any good stuff because I haven't even been able to check the new stock that uh, the, the merchant's gotten. But anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please do a like and a favorite. And subscribe if you're not ready to become a picky penguin. Aboard the SLP, where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. And as always, guys, till next time, stay classy!